Hi people, in this clip I'm going to show you how to use and sidechain a virtual vocoder in Ableton Live. Um, this procedure will work for any vocoder uh, except for the internal Ableton vocoder that's, uh, that works a little bit differently. However, um, I'm going to show the, our basic scheme for uh, using a vocoder in Ableton Live, then going to show you the second scheme that exactly what we're doing now. So this is a basic scheme for a vocoder in Ableton Live. You load it in a, a audio track and the same other track will be used as a modulation source. But um, ah, and then you need a MIDI track to send keyboard events to the vocoder. Okay, but this is not what we're going to use. So this is the scheme we're going to use now. Here the same audio track with the vocoder, and but this time we are not taking uh, the modulation source from the same audio track, but from an external audio track, because I want my voice to be processed by this FX chain. So what you're hearing right now is this. Okay, um, from here we'll pick this track here without effect, so in pre-effect. Then you have a MIDI track sending always keyboard events. And then we'll have one or two or more uh, MIDI tracks with the synthesizers of your choice. And this synthesizer will provide a new carrier for the vocoder. It means it will sidechain the, the vocoder. So, okay, this is the, the scheme we, you've just seen. So, this is my voice, processed voice by this chain, uh, effect chain. Uh, from the vocoder, by the way, we are, I'm using CS5000, that's one of the most powerful vocoder you can find. I'm taking, I'm picking the voice from here, as you can see, with, without effect, so pre-effect. Uh, then always the MIDI, tra uh, MIDI track uh, going to vocoder. And then we have several, one or two or more, you can add more uh, synthesizers of your choice, sending audio to vocoder. And um, if you have to use your vocoder without any sidechain, you have to use internal um, oscillators. So. In this case, these are all this, these are the oscillators. So they work this way. Yes, okay, you can hear it. Clearly right now. But what we have to do now is to sidechain it. So from this panel here, I choose sidechain select and voice and voice synth. I turn right this knob here and we will turn on uh, one by one these synths. So this is a church organ. This is, sounds very nice with a vocoder. So, and by the way, if you don't want uh, the sidechain uh, carrier to be mixed with internal uh, oscillators, we have to turn them off. So. That's it. So now you can hear the voice um, that modulates the church organ. Yeah, like this. Okay. Oh, yes. Yes. Yes, it's very fun. This is a very nice sound. Okay, so we added um, a church organ sound to the vocoder sidechain. 
Uh, now we switch off the um, church organ and we switch on massive uh, from native instruments as you can see now yeah like this okay we are using three oscillators with um, different kind of waveforms and a little bit um, detuned so we see now this is the sound okay this is the sound you can hear from this kind of waveform this is very nice at low frequencies okay this is medium frequency yeah oh uh, yes okay so um, you can choose also to mix together um, church organ and massive and so we'll have a much richer sound yes okay yeah yeah it works very oh, wow yes 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 yeah. You can also choose to mix all external side chains to the internal oscillator. So, okay, uh, we switch on, and there will be a richer than ever. Yes! Yes! <laughs> wow! Yes! I really love low frequencies that are really wonderful yeah. yes okay so you you just seen how to um sidechain uh, external carriers to a vocoder this procedure works for any vocoder as long as it has a sidechain option. So I hope you like it and I hope you like this clip and if you have any question, send comments. Bye.